Today I will be showing you how to change the input and output voltages on the E1T and E2T range of controllers. First, let's start with the input voltage. This can be changed between 230V and 110V by moving these jumpers. In this position the voltage is set to 110V and by moving to this side it is now set to 230V. To change the output voltages we can use these jumpers here and they can be set from 230V, 110V, 24 volt DC and 24 volt AC. These horizontal jumpers change the voltage from AC and DC and these volt vertical ones change the voltage from 230 volt, 110 volt and 24 volt. If I move the jumpers to this position it is now set to 110 volt. Once the jumpers are set we now need to change the settings in the menu. As you can see, the controller is showing an error because the wrong output voltage has been selected. The jumpers do not match the program. So if we clear the error by pressing OK, now press Set, and scroll up using the plus key to F05. Press OK to enter the menu. You can see it's set to D24, which is 24 volt DC. Using the plus key, we can scroll through them and select 115, which is 110 volt output. Press OK to select and then set one more time to come back out of the menu and the controller is now ready to use. 